Okay, good morning. I'm talking about the new self remote module. So I'm going to start in Xango right here. I go in the web pages and we'll start with the admin part of this new thing. So I click on the remote admin and the first field here at the top is the timeout. That is the number of seconds before I get kicked out. Don't worry, I'm going to have a warning before the timeout. And that's the number of shots that I'm allowed to do. I'm going to go to two. I just want to take two shots for just have a quicker demo. And what's the countdown here? It's currently at six seconds. I'm going to go to three seconds only. I go back to the main menu, scroll down to the remote. And that's the main screen for your photo boot. So you're going to go on full screen with the F11 key or I think double tap. It's going to work also. And from there, the participant is never going to touch any of your equipment. So I'm a regular dude coming in in the activation. I turn on my camera, the smartphone, just point at the QR code, and then, well, what's that? Point at the QR code, and then I can open the page, and that is going to open the remote so from here i'm i'm not on this i'm not on the same network i'm just on my regular 4g network and but i can still operate everything from here of course i need to be online but that's the only thing i can do and the qr code is valid only one so there's no one else that can take the control of the of the same uh, the same shot so we can see here that I'm at shot one of two because I set it to two pictures in the admin part. And we can see the same thing on the trigger button here, shot one of two. So I take the first one. This is my camera for the photo boot. I'm on burst mode. So I'm gonna have a dancing hand. So I always have my preview in the big monitor. And from my smartphone, I have a question. You want to keep this shot? Yeah, why not keep it? So now I can make my second and last shot. I click on trigger, I get my countdown. That's going to be the dancing flashlight. That's not really good, so I'm going to reject this one. I can take it again, so I'm still at my second shot. So trigger, I'm going to do a bigger, better one. Got my preview here. That's not really good, but I'm going to keep it anyway. So now that I took my two shots, I'm done. So the main screen here is reset to the QR code. So the next participant line can use the system. But as a participant here, I have the sharing form on my smartphone so I can share from here. And this whole screen can be customized by the admins of the logo, the background, the colors, the text in the header, the text in the footer, and all of that. Let me know what you think about that.